Good evening, good afternoon, good morning, wherever you are, whenever you are. Hello, thank you for watching my videos. It's Mike, it's February 11th, 2009. I've just been presented with some very interesting news. Now, there was an earlier news, I'll talk about it in a second. Um, this was yesterday's Daily Star. The Facebook Fiend! Um, basically, it's a story about uh, five murder cops warn women, do not date this man. Okay, he advertises via Facebook. Okay, there's a tiny little story in the sun, tiny little one, and then there's a much bigger one in the Independent. Now, I was going to mention this yesterday, but it was, you know, lots of other things happening. Why is that relevant? Well, <clears throat> I'm going to include a link to a Bloomberg article uh, from today. Italy debates law that may block access to Facebook. Essentially, um, uh, the Italian legislators are um, uh, going to be allowing the Interior Ministry to be able to block websites if prosecutors first verify the criminal content on the sites. Um, this is talking about Facebook and YouTube. Now, their big concern is that um, people are going to uh, rally together on the internet um, and do bad things, potentially. Um, so this is all getting back to the whole uh, people on YouTube are terrorists. There's so, the YouTube's just full of terrorists. <clears throat> yes. Uh, one of the Facebook groups that first sparked controversy last month with 481 fans proposes making... Uh, I can't pronounce that. Prozenzano who was convicted of, of ordering more than a dozen mur murders, a saint. A group for Rina, which was known as The Beast for his penchant for violence and murder, has 945 members whose comments include, you're my idol, you're the best. Basically, the, the media is being rolled out into a, um, a whole campaign against Facebook and against YouTube um, that we are the cause. Okay. Second news story, m much more important. European banks may need massive bailout. Again, it's linked at the side. If you want to see my links, you click on the more info, it, it expands down. Okay, well, actually, I guess it's down there now. Uh, more info, it will expand down. There's a list of everything I talk about, so you can go check this yourself. So I suggest anybody new who doesn't know about this, go check these links. These are real. Um, a secret 17-page document discussed by finance ministers, including the Chancellor Alistair Darling on Tuesday, warned European banks are sitting on 16.3 trillion pounds of toxic assets. Uh, they may suffer massive losses according to a confidential Brussels document. Basically, this is a leaked document. What are they getting us ready for? Be ready, folks. Peace, love, understanding. Think about things. <laughs>